Hey everybody, Ricky Adam Handicapping. Thoroughbred racing from my hometown track, Penn National Race Course on Thursday evening, March the 8th. This is my day at the track.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race one, the opener this evening, folks. 6 p.m. Eastern Post Time. Six furlong sprint on the dirt track. Phillies and mares, four years old, and up race for a claiming prize of some $18,000. Contenders number five, Oratoria. Number four, Fire and Forget. Number two, Bold Question. And number three, Irish Garden. Number five, Oratoria is the overall speed leader in this claiming field. Tonight, sprinting at six furlongs on the dirt, has hit the board in power run fashion in three of her last four, including back-to-back -back power run wins in her last two starts. Jockey Gerald Molivar and trainer Kevin Patterson send her to the post for the Thursday night opener. They fit the board with 65% of their entry saddle as a team to date. Number four, Fire and Forget has hit the board in four of her last five with three of those efforts, including a win in her fourth race back, also qualifying as power runs. Race one summary number five, Oratoria tops my contenders list tonight, which also includes number four, Fire and Forget, number two, Bold Question, and number three, Irish Garden, five, four, two, three in the first tonight from Penn National. Bonus long shots stay right here at Penn Nat. Race five to six to one shot. Number seven, Veronica's Lake takes a class drop of five track master units, the overall speed leader in this claiming field. Sprinting at six furlongs on the dirt. Charlestown, race five, entry number four, time for a winner. Four to one in the morning line, qualifies as a track master plus power pony. Takes a six level class drop, good speed for this four in one half furlong sprint. So from Penn National on a Thursday night, Rick Needham for dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.